Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide. We are on February 5th, 2025. Welcome to another Surviving Day on the Planet. And welcome to the Volcano Activity Report, as well as the planetary positions. As I like to show where our planets are in our solar system right now. As we still have a big collection of all of our planets in one corner of the solar system. We've got Venus coming around getting ready for a spring equinox retrograde. Got Mercury on the back side of the sun. Able to see that on Lasco 2 showing our sun in the past 48 hours. This is the look at all our friends in our solar system. As we are going through planetary alignments and peculiar positionings, Venus approaching, approaching a retrograde, which comes right around springtime in March. Put this into motion for the next little bit. And that's where we will see the Mercury retrograde right after spring. We've seen multiple volcanic eruptions over this last little while. That's why today we need a volcanic activity report where we're reporting 76 active volcanoes across this planet. That's right, 76. This is the most I've ever reported on this channel, and it just keeps getting higher. So let's start out here in the Aleutian Islands with the Great Sitkin volcano and as well Katmai orange levels. Hawaii, Kilauea Volcano, marking the start of the eighth phase, just started the eruption yesterday. Down into Mexico, Popopacatitl, always active, puffing every day. Same with Santa Maria, or sorry, Santa Guito, and Fuego. We've got Tlica. Messiah, Conception, Recon de la Veja, Paus, down into South America, Colombia, Nevadas de Ruiz, Parachi, Reventador, Cotopaxi, Sangue, and off the coast of the Nazca Plate. Fernandina. Heading down into parts of Peru, we've got Sabincaya, Ubinas. Increasing seismicity through the region, as you can see. In Chile, Copohu, Calaqui, and Villarica. Now that Calaqui, that's a new one as well. That's one of the four that are new this week. And of course, we've got the Michael Volcano. South Sandwich Islands, the African Plate, which has been very active as of late. We've got the Niragongo Volcano and near Marigira. Just east, Old Doño, Langal, and then moving north here, into the Somalia plate, Fantail, erupted December 29th. And then a few days later, on the, on the 5th of January, Dauphin, Erta Ale, a volcano. So that's six volcanoes on the African continent that are erupting now. And then we get to Greece, and we've got the situation there. Big earthquake swarm northeast of Santorini Volcano. Hundreds of earthquakes through the region, and as well, Colombo Volcano showing unrest. That is a submarine volcano. Do you remember our last submarine volcano? Hunga Tonga Hapai, just before COVID. Italy, Mount Etna, and as well, Stromboli. 
and notable, showing signs of unrest. Can't be flagrant. Way too close to Pompeii. The earthquakes are moving northwestward. All right, let's carry on here into the Sunda Plate. Starting in India, where we've got the Barren Island Volcano. Silua, Agam, Marapi, Karinchi, Dempo, the mighty Krakatoa, Marapi. Man, look at all the volcanoes and activity down here, folks. Semaru, Rung, Agung, Luatobi, and Luatolo. Up into the Philippines, we've seen a couple awaken through the region there as well at the Sunda Plate, Ibu Volcano and Dakono. As well, Gamalama, January 5th, Rung, Karangatang, Tal Volcano, Mayan Volcano, and as well, Canyon. Moving up into Japan at the Philippine Sea, of course, we got Iwo Jima, Nishinoshima, Suisunajima, Sekirajima. Heading up into Russia, in Kamchatka, the Alade Volcano, Ebako, Shivaluch, Bezimiani, as well, Kluchevskoy, and Karamiski. And yet, yeah, we still have multiple volcanoes to report here. Heading down into Papua New Guinea, where we've got the Manam Volcano, Uluan, and Bagana, Solomon Islands, Tinakula, Aoba, and as well, earthquakes here at the New Herbig's Plate, at the Yasser Volcano, And as well, Matthew Island Volcano. East at the, close to the Honga Tonga, we've got the Home Reef. And as well, Tofua. Notable White Island. Updated there on the January 28th. And of course, the mighty Erubus in Antarctica. So yeah, folks, 76 active and erupting volcanoes across the planet over double the amount that I used to report when I first started reporting here on YouTube seven years ago. Just saying, we've seen some pretty catastrophic volcanic events unfold over this past little while. And it would not surprise me if we're at 100 volcanoes by the end of the year. Much love, everybody. Stay aware and prepared. This is looking at our sulfur dioxide emissions forecast for the next three days, showing notable plume there at Kilauea in the Pacific Ocean, and as well some nasty air quality all across Southeast Asia, Africa, and Europe. Here's a look at infrared imagery showing the Kilauea caldera as the magma flow has stopped compared to what it was at last night and is already starting to cool that fresh layer of lava. Hope you enjoyed this show. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe. Love and respect one another. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your daily due. We'll see you for tonight's update.